Neighbors here on Ohio Street on Detroit's northwest side say they thought someone was setting up fireworks over the weekend until we heard the scream and that's when we knew it wasn't fireworks. It sounded like the beginning of an early 4th of July celebration. You thought they were fireworks. Yeah. That's how neighbors here on Ohio Street describe what went down Friday night. Boom, 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 you know. At first we ignored it. The fireworks have been going even what since May. Here Detroit police say a man had been sitting on his porch around 10 p.m. when an unknown suspect ran up, shot him several times, killing him, and took off. There wasn't any activity or commotion. There weren't people outside. There wasn't music. And the story similar across the city over the weekend. More than 15 people shot, at least four people killed. Our overall crime is down. Property crime is down uh, substantially. Uh, but of course, our homicides and shootings are up. Friday night, police say the body of a 19-year-old man was found wrapped in a blanket here on Elmdale on the city's east side. But Detroit Police Chief James Craig says last weekend wasn't as bad as the weekend prior. Given, you know, the stay-at-home orders, uh, certainly the stress associated with the disease, Tempers are much higher. Craig attributing much of the mayhem in the city and in other larger cities to violent offenders being released on lower personal bonds or some released on tethers due to the pandemic. It's one thing to let someone out who has a warrant for failure to pay child support as compared to someone who is in custody for uh, an assault with intent to commit murder. Craig says over the last week, Detroit police arrested 85 people for carrying concealed weapons and recovered 119 firearms. We're seeing the same argument-based uh, activities that erupt quickly into someone deciding to use a gun. And as the temperatures are set to rise to the mid-90s this week and into the 4th of July weekend, many neighbors here on edge. We need more patrol out here at night. Especially with the fireworks. In Detroit, Erica Erickson, Fox 2 News.